Let's get salty! Everyone, Zeddy here again today with a bonus gameplay video. I was at the uh, Hearthstone's uh, early access twist event where we got to play against other content creators, try out the new stuff, the new mode, and I had a blast playing a deck I used to love to play not that long ago because this twist season is pretty recent, but Hero Power Mage. And I think it's going to be a force because they reverted the, ner the nerf to Dawn Grasp. Uh, when they went to wild, but we got new additions that we didn't get to play with this deck before, like star power, like volume up, work really well. Getting extra wildfires is really pretty strong. Uh, this is a list I took from Ben at work, who's always a top uh, legend wild player, and it's a really fun deck. It's obviously not going to be refined. Maybe you run like Infantize a Maxitude. There might be other stuff to do but you have like Amplified Snow Flurry, which rotated obviously a while ago, but Arcane Artificer, that wasn't buffed back in the day. So it's a really nice spice of it. And I had a lot of fun. I only lost like one game. Deck did incredibly well. And I do expect, you know, the Reckless Apprentice and Mordresh to still carry weight. I love this style of deck. I just really enjoy it. And I know a lot of you guys out there do too. So I thought I would highlight some games and, uh, some excitement, some hype for uh, Hearthstone Twist. Let me know if you enjoy this content. I can upload some more gameplay videos. And of course, if you enjoy the video, please like and subscribe. Have a great day and stay salty, my friends. I've never played against that a lot. Now Zeta was a qu uh, quest priest main for quite a while. I wonder if that's what he's playing. I'm excited to play against Zeta. I did play Questline Druid, but it, it's so much the... Uh, it's so much the same as before. The hardest decks to play in Hearthstone. Uh, Gigantis, thank you for the Prime Gaming as well. Another first time. Sup? Thank you, thank you. Hope you're doing well. Staying safe, staying healthy, staying salty. Thank you, thank you. I'm doing the... Oh, the giveaways after this game. Sorry. This game might just go a while because it's Zeta playing as slow deck probably. But I would have it no other way. Mm, there's not a lot of frost spells in this deck. And PR gifting five subs as well. What is going on, you guys? Thank you. Uh, if you got gifted a sub, Qvinimin, have all the ants. Um, Kid of the Eng L71983 Menton, thank you, thank you so much. Enjoy the gifted subs, Pioch, that's super generous. Agritics Have a good night, Buddhas. Oh, I'll probably wait for the next giveaway. All right, no problem. Sorry, I should have done it earlier. That's my bad. Are some of the hardest decks to play in Light show? I got another one. one sub to L71983. Are some of the hardest I don't have Mordresh though, so, I hope or, uh, gifted a tier one I don't have, um, the nine drops, and I bet it's not great. Fuck, giveaways are like your stream, well thank you. But giveaways are nice too. Who doesn't love a good giveaway, right? I think this deck has some potential to twist a hero power mage. Like they unnerfed on grass and she's a broken card or sorry, they're, they're a broken card. <clears throat> but nine packs is hard to pass up. Yeah, no kidding, eh? Well, enjoy. Um, oof. I kind of want another wildfire. I don't think I care about the one. Agrodex are some of the hardest decks to play in Hearthstone. Kyoke 1979 gifted a tier 1 sub to Mutok. They have given 10 gift subs in the channel. And Piag gifting a sub to Metalhawk as well. Thank you again, Piag. That's super generous. 10 total. You guys have been out of this world today. Thank you. Do we know what the banned cards are? I don't think there are any banned cards in the first season. Unless they decide to do any afterwards. You never know. And we got a raid from the Geminator as well. We're getting all the raids. Bridget, Geminator. If you uh, if you want to watch somebody play the worst rogue decks ever, but play them the best, and they're also really fun to watch, follow Jim. He's fantastic at playing trash, but doing it well. And it's also fun trash. So absolutely... Uh, 
knowledge. Give the old Geminator a follow. It also has some fun green screen stuff and has interesting takes on Star Wars movies, like thinking the prequels are actually good. Cack. <laughs> Alright, I'll play this. The prequels are actually good. They're not! I even tried watching them uh, two weeks ago because it's been a long time. Like, maybe they've aged better. And I tried watching them. They're still terrible. The, the writing is so bad. The writing in the prequels is so bad. The casting's great. The storyline itself is fine, but the writing and the directing... The special effects are atrocious. I can't get over it. I just can't. I'm a boomer. I was a kid when that shit came out. I was in high school or whatever. All right, well, Dawn Grass next turn. Still better than the sequels. I'll agree with you on that. I like episode seven. I don't care what anybody says. I like episode seven, but eight and nine are some of the worst films I've ever seen in my life. But I like episode seven. Rogue Let's One is fine. The solo movie's not even that bad. Is this. The solo movie's watchable. You wish to match wits with me. Episode 7 is episode 4. Yeah, that's why it's not that bad. But I totally agree with you. Really? Nice. I'm trying to murder Zed a lot. Solo is disposable, okay? Yeah, it's completely unnecessary. It, it, it's a movie that doesn't need to exist, but it's fine. One of the giveaways after this game, we're doing our next one. Then we have two more? Yeah, one at two and one at three. I haven't watched The Clone Wars, but I have heard it's decent. Those we love are never truly Thoughts on Fast and Furious? I liked Fast Five. That's it. <laughs> I liked Fast Five. I, th I thought it was alright. I didn't like Fast One or Two or Tokyo Drift or the fourth one or the sixth. I don't know. I just, they're okay. But Five's fun. Yeah, they should nerf Thaddeus. Yeah, I mean, Thaddeus is a standalone card. He'll never get nerfed. He'll be his mana cheaters, but you can always hope. Yeah, I'm indifferent to fast, but damn, I love Furious. Drift was character building for Han. True. The main actor of that movie was terrible. Terrible. Oh! We have so much damage. How does he outscale this? He's probably getting PTSD. Oh my god. This is not fair. Oh. I know you said you have two copies of Thaddeus. You want that extra dust. I, I respect it. Like Frozen? The Frozen movie? Frozen's alright. The uh, Disney animated movie? Let it go. Dude, this, this five spot's just annoying. <laughs> this is so toxic. Why am I the way I am?
See your fr oppression of the new mode? Any outliers? Uh, Questrude's could be broken. I think Questrude will be by far the best deck. But it's counterable. But it's going to feel very much like wild. But people are playing fun decks today, so... It's really impossible to say. Nobody wants to play that because it's just the same deck in wild and... It's not even fun to play. Brute DH? I don't know. Without Tony... I don't know. Maybe. It's all about scamming early or else you're not winning, I don't think. It's gotta be a different build. The late game- there's no late game with it anymore. Pure Pala? Probably won't be that good, no. It'll be okay, but not top tier. Oh, GG. Yeah, Corbett's participating. I don't know. He might be on now, or some people start later. It's a 12 hour thing, right? So, weird. A lot of hunters all of a sudden. Stop winning your points. Wait, is there a Gamba going on? What's the Gamba going on right now? Which will be first? Three wins, three losses. Oh, Scarlet got one going. Stack's pretty good. It's this quest again. Fix the drops? I'm working on it. Oh, Kibler got an achievement. What's the most fun deck matchup you've ever had without being completely one-sided game? I'm such a sore loser that I never have fun when I lose. <laughs> I, I honestly have no idea what the answer to that question is. I'm so toxic. <laughs> I'm so toxic. I just, I hate losing so much. The only fun matchup I have is the one I win. I don't know. The, the, like these events, I don't care about losing. It's fun because it's just, we're having fun, right? But on ladder, I'm such a little bitch. I'm such a bitch. Do not look away. I, I, I keep trying to work on it, but I just can't. I was the same way when I played hockey, when I was competitive in anything. I hate losing, and I, I'm just a horrible loser. Just ask any of my teammates in hockey. Like, I would... Man, I was competitive. Is there a way to make a fun meta if losing is never fun? I don't know. Ooh, Zigzor. I missed that card. It's a cool card. Are some of the hardest Quarterback with the Prime Gaming. Thank you very much. Hope you're doing well. Staying safe. Staying health. Staying salty. Thank you. Thank you. Man, this used to have three durability. Enjoy the 40 plus emotes. Dude, what's the sub count at? You guys won't stop. We're at 522 subs. What the hell? We started today at like 47 or 370. Thank you. What's my favorite keyword? Mm. Tradable? Tradable has been a pretty good one. I'm not gonna lie, I kind of like tradable. Have a good night, David. Thought it was a pretty good addition to the, uh, to the, uh, the game. Hello from Rarn. Is Rarn done already? Or, oh, is, wait, Rarn's still going, but Agritics greetings. Some of the hardest decks to play in Hearthstone. Keep the sub train rolling. Or is he heading off? Oh, he's heading off. Gotcha. Uh, Hot Sauce, thank you for the tier one, three months of continued support. Oh, right. it was a spoiler. We're getting a Rarn raid after he bullied me. Do I even want the Rarin raid? I don't know, man. He kicked the living crap out of us. <laughs> hope you had a good stream, Rarin. I had a lot of fun with this stuff. I hope you had a, a lot, I hope you had fun. That, that, by the way, the Rafon portrait, god tier. Absolute god tier. Thoughts on the mode? Really fun. The fact that like they can change the rules at any time, like I love it. It's just like, are people going to play it because they have to have the old cards. It's like duels all over again, you know? I'm worried about it. I'm worried about that. 
I don't know, skeletons are fun. That's all I worry about. I'm not a big fan of this twist, because screw Stormwind. I would have loved to see the first twist not have United and Stormwind. But the potential for the mode is literally limitless. When you can set whatever formats, whatever rules, you can ban cards, you can do whatever. Like, it's a limitless p potential, just can people play it? That's the big problem, and I hope they find a way around it. But other than that, I love it. I think it's, a, it's all, I've asked for this forever. This is what I've wanted forever. It's perfect for someone like me. I have all the cards. So I, you know, it's great for me. I don't have to worry about it. I have all the cards, but you gotta have other people to play against. So that, that's more important. So, um, but I think it's really, really cool. And I'm glad they're doing it. And I, I have confidence in Matt and the team to figure out a way to, uh, to make it accessible. Like I know, like, you know, we, we've been involved for a while. Uh, they they know the, what the the issues are. At least uh, it seemed that way. Um, guess the order doesn't matter. Do I play this? No, I'll play this. Yeah. But yeah, if you guys don't follow Ron, I know he doesn't stream on YouTube or Twitch all that much, but you may have heard of him. He's a pretty big deal on YouTube as well as streams mostly on YouTube. So if you drop him a follow, whatever platform, and uh, thank you very much for the raid. I really appreciate it. And we, we, haven't, we haven't talked in quite a while. We should catch up at some point. It's been a while. We're both like always busy though. Aggro decks are some of the hardest decks. MJ Vyer, thank you for the Prime Gaming first time sub. Hope you're doing well. Stayed safe, stayed healthy, stayed salty. Enjoy our um enjoy the 40 emotes. Thank you guys. Thank you, Ryan. Have a good one, my dude. We'll we'll catch up as we always do. Uh this is a problem because I can't deal with it. Well, Ryan and I have collabed quite a bit. I was I was the first ever one on uh do you know hearthstone i was the i was the test subject so uh, uh we've had some we've had some good fun together all right we do this Am I still bronze? Yeah, we got two star bonuses. Rarn, your favorite Marvel. Rarn has the exact same conclusion with Marvel Snap as me. It took a bit long. He didn't start playing until later, but it didn't take too long for him to come to the exact same feelings as me. Because, you know, it sucks. <laughs> we both really like the game. We both really like the game, but we absolutely cannot tolerate the... Uh, the monetization, it is just atrocious. Absolutely atrocious. Dude, that's a full on achievement. I'm probably hero powering next turn. I want to leave it flexible. If, if I waste the mana, it's fine. I, I was the first one to really call out Snap's monetization because I played in beta and they pulled even worse shit in beta, but I, I knew it would happen and yeah, that's bad. Do you know if the battle ready decks are available right away? No, they're not available now. They'll be available later. All right, I guess we're getting rid of this. So I have to kill that. Drop shouldn't be bugged, no. I have no card draw here, this is bad. No Dawngrass, no draw. 
Let's take double wildfire, I guess. Do you think Wreckful would have loved Twist? No idea, but I miss Wreckful. Didn't have many interactions with him, but I had one short, tiny conversation with him, and it was, oh my god. I mean, you're not trading, you're going face. Alright. Well, we have some stall. But what we really need is a hero. Um. We need like a Mordresh or something. Mordresh, Reckless, Dawn Grasp. But we're we're kind of up. We just didn't draw well. Is there more card draw we could add to this deck? I don't think so. I think we just whiffed. Your head head out. It's around eleven o'clock in the Netherlands. All right. Have a good night, Cthulhu Gaming. Thanks for hanging out. Appreciate it. It's really hard for me. I, I average like two to three hundred viewers, and tonight we've had over two thousand. So. <laughs> It's been hard to keep up with chat, but hopefully I'm doing an okay job. Thank you guys. I mean, he's just board locked, right? Can they just die? Just don't play anything. Solid alibi is toxic. Yup. And in wild, you can play it with ice block. That's fun. Didn't read every chat message, I know. Am I playing Zelda off stream? Not yet. I'm really struggling with the bad graphics. I just played through both God of Wars and going to Zelda is really hard. Cause um, the God of War games are like huge and they look beautiful. Well, that was toxic. That deck seems pretty legit. Let's play with it till we lose. I like it. How do you feel about Ragnarok? I loved it.